Chuckload of Comics is brought to you by Cold War Games, creators of Squarriors, Fight Your Friends, and Lady Death Last Stand. For more information, visit coldwar.us. Absolutely. So guys, let us know what you're excited about this week in the comments section. Let's go ahead and get into this week's nerd news. Well, guys, our first big story of the day, Disney Plus, the streaming service that drops November 12th. It's going to cost you $7.99, or I'm sorry, $6.99 a month, but if you want to get it for less than $4, you can, but you got to act fast. If you're watching the show before September 2nd, here's what you do. Do you want to get Disney Plus for $3.90 a month? Here's what you do. So this just <laughs> dropped. Me up. This blew me away. Like I saw this. This was kind of dropped sort of under the radar. They didn't put it on blast for everybody, but it happened just after D23. Go to D23.com. You know, D23 is the big Disney convention. Happens out in Anaheim. Just happened the other week. If you go to D23.com and make yourself a login, totally free, just make yourself an account at D23.com. They're going to send you an email with a link. That link is going to send you to the purchasing page, sort of the sign-up page for Disney+. Plus. You have to sign up for three years. So it's a three-year plan. you got to pay $140 up that, that's front. It. That's it. Exactly. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> that's it. But if you, do, if you do the math, $140 a month split over three years, you're basically getting a year for free. Right. Yeah. No, definitely. That, sign me up, especially with uh, like the Mandalorian coming out. All the Star Wars stuff, all the Marvel stuff. All of it. Um, we did it, and it worked. We signed up. We're good. It's actually like 150 after taxes and stuff. I don't know if that's a Chicago thing, like with their entertainment taxes. When, oh yeah, yeah, that's a new thing. But still, it? man, you get it. You basically get a year for free. Yeah. Um, so yeah. Go, again, just to recap: go to d23.com, sign up. You're going to receive an email. This ends on September 2nd. So if hopefully you're watching Chuckload of Comics when you're supposed <laughs> right. to be watching Chuckload of that's Comics, because right. um, yeah. after September 2nd you missed out on it. So you're going to have to pay 7.99 or 6.99 a month. This is interesting because when they announced the price of six ninety nine a month, every first thing everybody thought was, "Yeah, sure, that's the introductory rate." They're gonna jack up the right, price, right. and they're going to. I mean, without a doubt. So, right. three years from now, it's probably gonna be a twenty five dollar. Yeah, I mean, price tag. even a year from now. I mean, yeah. you think about what it's gonna cost. I mean, uh, I remember when Netflix was like what ten bucks for the DVD right. disc service plus mm -hmm. you know the digital content, and I think we're now sitting at like twelve ninety nine just just for the streaming. You're just for the streaming exactly, and then uh, you know they'll have I'm sure they'll have like HD options where you can do four K stream of four K or yep. whatever, uh, which will cost you more money. But I mean, at, at this price. I know what I'm doing on the you're, way home. You're crazy not to do it. Yeah. I mean, because you're locked in for three years, and there's just so much awesome content that's going to be coming out. So, guys, go to d23.com before September 2nd and just make a member. There's paid memberships. Don't get suckered into buying one of those gold or platinum memberships because that's where you get, like, the discounts into the parks and stuff. Just do the free one. Right. Yep. Yep. Do and that. you're going to get that email as long as you do it before September 2nd. So, guys, let us know. Are you excited about the Disney Plus? Let us know in the comments section. How stoked are you? So, next big story of the week, guys, Birds of Prey. Very interesting. This is sort of a sneaky thing. There was a teaser trailer that was uh, stolen. Somebody stole the teaser trailer, took a bunch of screenshots of what this teaser trailer is going to show, and put those screenshots online. Those have since been taken down. The trailer has been taken down. But we, uh, the social media junkies that we are, found these photos, snagged them before they got taken down. Let's take a look at them. I mean...